hearing from Coach Jim Calhoun, the Hall of Famer just accused of sexual discrimination on the job. Tonight, he is denying those claims and speaking out. Fox 61's Zania Maldonado has been following this lawsuit. She has reaction. She joins us now with the very latest. Zania? Audrey Calhoun released a two-page statement this weekend, firing back at those accusing him of, quote, fostering a boys' club atmosphere and unfair treatment. I am angry and hurt that the reputation that I've worked so hard to achieve for over 50 years was so easily dismissed and thrown aside in return for headlines. That's part of the lengthy response from Hall of Fame coach Jim Calhoun, reacting to a lawsuit filed by the former associate athletic director for the University of St. Joseph. Jacqueline Piscatelli filing the sex discrimination lawsuit naming Calhoun against the university on Wednesday. Piscatelli accused the school of fostering a boys club atmosphere and says she was mistreated in her role after the arrival of Calhoun. Calhoun, the current coach for the St. Joe's basketball team, stating, I have firmly and unequivocally at no time knowingly treated any woman unfairly because of her gender. In addition, let me be clear, I have never treated any woman inappropriately. In the lawsuit, Piscatelli alleges Calhoun made a statement to her saying, quote, she's certainly hot and describes an incident where Calhoun, quote, knocked over a number of K-cups onto the floor and stepped on them and made the plaintiff clean them up, stating that if he made such a mess at home, his wife would clean up after him. Calhoun denied the allegations in his statement, explaining how he has supported women's rights for as long as he can remember. Firing back, I'm not sure when asking a colleague if they would mind opening the door because my hands were full became discrimination. And call me old fashioned in this regard, I use the word hot to describe the weather and the temperature of my morning coffee. And the only woman I openly compliment is my wife of 53 years. The former UConn coach also pointing out in his statement, he spent the last eight years at UConn proudly working under a president who was a woman and is, quote, excited that the new athletic department at USJ is under the direction of a woman. The university released a statement amidst the allegation stating it is taking the matter seriously but does not comment on pending litigation. Audrey.